everybody and thank you for clicking on this video and in this one I am going to be bringing you some Kino to Totem gameplay training on the stage and in this video I'm going to be telling you what looks like Shadows of Evil is going to try to be a Transit 2.0 in a good way so let's dive into it. So if you do not know, about a couple of days ago at this point, Treyarch released the complete achievements and trophy list for Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Which you might not find as such a great information, but hear me out. The reason why it's good is it kind of describes some portions of the campaign, trailer, and multiplayer. For example, some of the achievements says like complete such and such mission on a hardened or veteran mode. So you can find out some of the names of the stories. And that is some good information. And one way in, in Zombies, one of the th achievements says something like use the trolley in Shadows of Evil. And this is very useful because then you can find out that there is a trolley in Shadows of Evil. And what it looks like to me that trailer is trying to make transit but only a good way. If you're kind of confused, I get it, but if you think about it, the idea of transit was a good idea. It's supposed to be an open world, open-ended zombies experience, which I really like. But the only thing is, the execution was very poor because they made it mandatory that you use the bus to transverse the map. What transit did was the fog. The reason why the fog was there in transit was because on the Xbox 360 and the PlayStation 3, Black Ops 2 could not handle complete and diverse open world in those areas. What they did was they decided to put fog in the areas that they could not render out. Which is actually, if you think about it, is a good idea. But it really wasn't because it made some very open areas of just complete fog and denizens. So uh, not that many people like the denizens and it basically even more forced you to use the bus to transverse the map. And that is one thing that Transit really failed on and that it looks like that they're trying to improve that in Shadows of Evil which basically make Transit but only take out all the garbage in Transit. And I think that that is fantastic. And another thing, what I think that they should do when it comes to the trolley system is don't make it like the bus. Because the, like I said, the bus was mandatory to transverse the map. And if they do that, they're going to get another transit. And I really think that Shadows of Evil is going to be a good map. They implement a lot of good things. And that is really what I want to say for this video. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, please remember to leave a like. And if you really like my stuff, subscribe. And thank you once again for watching this video. And goodbye.